Hello everyone, Simon here. Welcome back to the Minecraft Trains project. Uh, I am building paths through the snow right now. Before I start today though, the uh, Minecraft Cliffs and Caves Part 2 is coming out in a couple of days. So starting next week, I'm gonna I'm gonna like this is gonna be the, the last Minecraft trains thing for a while. I'm gonna take a break from this and go do like a survival playthrough of the Cliffs and Caves expansion. Not sure when I would end that, but uh, I just wanna like, I guess it's a play until I get bored, I guess. <laughs> um, one possible goal is to build at least one of every resource farm. <laughs> Which would take a long time actually. Anyway, so so next week is gonna be Cliffs and Caves Survival. Taking a break from uh from this creative. But uh for now let's continue this path here. Which how do I wanna do this? Uh, this is kind of awkward. I'm doing this two blocks wide, right? So I'm gonna like do that there. And I guess it would make sense if... Let's go up a little bit. There. Like that. Make sure that doesn't sit on snow. Right. Is that ice under there? A little bit. Let's pretend it's not. Alright, there, there. And uh, let's go ahead and step up. To there, and then we have a bit of a split here, huh? Um, let me go ahead and do that. And then here, I guess we'd go this way instead. And then. Uh, Um, that's ice underneath there. I mean, it's empty underneath there. And then... Let's go ahead and do that. Cool. Alright, great. So here, we need to staircase down here and then up that hill. The staircase, I think, is gonna, like, go above the snow. So that means, um, wood planks. Well, I mean, if I can get this to work. And then back into the uh, back into the stone. Um, I'm gonna make this a proper staircase, right? We 
grab that. It's kind of narrow here, isn't it? Is it always that narrow? Yeah, it kind of is. I do. I put lights on the bridges, right? Yes. So I'm just thinking. Do I also put lights on on the staircase here? Uh, that's awkward. <laughs> I don't know what this is. What is this? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Um, Maybe it's just that. That makes more sense, actually. Alright, let's just have that, and then we go this way. Ice. We we put plank over the ice. Like that. And then this is fairly steep. Not sure how I. This is gonna be, have to be a staircase too. Hold on, let me. Do like a, a proper staircase here. Man, it's a staircase all the way up to here, huh? So let's say. At the top here. Let's have a staircase like rise above the ground. Um, up here we have that, and then I had a little camping spot on the other in the other places. Let me um, check how I did that. Like a three by five there, and then a furnace. Two, three. Oops. One, two, three, four, five. All right. So there's that, and then there's a serious staircase here, which. Let's say, 
Hey, Hava. Did you see the news? Cliffs and Caves is coming out in a few days. Um, I'm going to switch over to a Cliffs and Caves survival playthrough next week. So no, no trains for a while. I'm going to do a, a new playthrough, new world, new playthrough survival. And then see how long that goes for. And then after that, come back to this. How is this might have to start a new run if I can stand the new graphics? <laughs> I mean... Oh, you can get... you can use a... Uh... Hold on. Oh crap, I didn't mean to quit. You can you can use old textures, like if you Oh I don't know if like resource packs. You can go uh Minecraft classic texture pack if you want to. <laughs> anyway, let me just keep playing. Hava says any ideas on what your goal will be? I'm not sure, Hava. I mean I guess like kill the Ender Dragon. But that, that, that doesn't take too long. Um, maybe I will like build... I was thinking one possible thing to do is to build at least one of every automated resource generator. Uh, that's, that would take a long time though. Because I'm like I'm interested in uh, in automation, right? So I like the idea of automation. So I might just like do that and see how how far I get with that. Um, this is awkward. There's a bit of snow in the way. I I don't think I will do any big architecture things. How do you? Oh, I know. Do this. Try and do like. Flip over and do the underside of staircases. So the cliffs and caves, there's no, there's no deep dark. They push that back to the the next expansion. Oh, that's there. I can raise that staircase up a little bit. Well, no, I can't because it's gonna be this. Never mind. All right, so that's the staircase. Uh, let me do that. How says that's a very steep trail. It is. <laughs> well, sometimes when you want to climb a mountain. You have to uh, work those legs. <laughs> it's just... I mean, it's a staircase. It's it's not a you know it's not a slope. So <laughs> this is before. Well, this is not before. But you look at some of the uh, old staircases from before there was work safety laws. You get really steep staircases. I 
Like those mountains in China? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. How do I want to do this? Doesn't quite fit, does it? How is this only serious hikers? That's right. Advanced. <laughs> Advanced hiking. Uh, only people with leg muscles. <laughs> How high is that? I'll figure that out later on. Go there, there. as well. Doesn't really do anything that one. And there. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so the fourth one What should I do in the survival playthrough? I mean we can like collect at least one of every item, <laughs> right? Actually, how hard would that be? Co <laughs> collect one of every item? I mean, that'd be interesting, right? <laughs> I mean, we can, you can't get the eggs. I'm not sure if I care about the tipped arrows. But I guess it wouldn't be that hard to get one of each tipped arrows. Oh, music discs would be a pain in the ass. You can't pick the end portals up. <laughs> and then enchanting books. Get one of every enchanting book. <laughs> it wouldn't be that hard, would it? I mean, it would take a while, but it wouldn't be, like, impossible. Banner patterns? Maybe not the banner patterns. Some of them are kind of... Well, no, you just have to farm villages. Can you get- oh, the heads. The heads are com hard to get. How is this? I enjoy watching you build villages, like from scratch, so your own house designs. Yeah, I-, I The thing is... Maybe, maybe. I didn't want to like... I don't really want to do architecture in survival anymore, just because of the amount of grinding required to get materials. But maybe, however. Maybe, like, after I set up the the resource farms and I have like I don't have to grind for resources maybe then I'll like build architecture how is this but I guess it doesn't really play into the new stuff into the game well we can like build stuff with new materials I guess I basically don't want to grind. I mean, I stopped the old survival playthrough because it became grind. <laughs> like, you know, just, just shoveling sand to make glass, just like... pickaxing stone just to get stones. Don't want to do that anymore. How was this? Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. But we'll see, we'll see. Because one of the things I want to try to do is just see like what kind of stuff we can automate, right? And and I've said before, it might turn out that I'll just like <laughs> build houses out of 
watermelons and pumpkins because you can automate watermelons and pumpkins. <laughs> Which would be you know, an interesting architectural challenge, trying to make a serious looking house with pumpkins. But 